Hello everyone, welcome back to another one. It's been a while since uh, I've seen you. I apologize for that, but uh, hey, we'll pick it back up again. Um, I was actually just on um, before playing around with the new features in 1.5. Um, I didn't want to get too far into it though, so I only made some, you know, played around with the rails and stuff, trying to figure it out. But we're going to play around with those more together. That and getting ladders where I need more ladders now because of the change to ladders. Um, but, uh, oops, which seems to make things more interesting. But um, I think what we're going to do right now is we're going to play with some of the features with. Uh, with the new booster rails and the new features of 1.5, the achievements and whatnot, which the achievements are found here. Um, I've already done the getting wood, or the taking inventory of getting wood. So, um, so I could kind of work on some of these achievements as well, which a lot of them are, it's kind of a tutorial type thing, I believe. It's kind of a, uh, oops, get back here. Um, kind of a try to get people to understand the game so they kind of uh, you know take a um, you know look what your inventory is like uh, knock down a tree make a workbench then you make some basic tools so you make a, a pickaxe you make a sword you make a hoe I like how it doesn't have you make an axe it's interesting um, so you make all that stuff and then you go uh, you know and then you upgrade you get a new one and all that other stuff you make a so you mine some cobble, you make a uh, furnace, cook some fish. Surprised they don't have you cook ham. Uh, smelt some iron, make some tracks or something. Up. Do something with track. Um, so yeah, oh look, cake. The lie. I like that one. That's good. That's cute. I like the wallpaper, the background that he uses for it too. The diamond and the bedrock down there. That's kind of neat. Uh, so anyways, I was playing around on my own, and by the way, I've noticed that the game runs a lot smoother now with this update. I'm liking it a lot. Um, I'm even recording, and usually when I'm recording, I've noticed some stutter, and I really need to fix that. Um, I noticed some stutter, but right now it's just smooth as silk. And, you know, and I have all the settings. Oops, video settings. So I've got, uh, I like the GUI scale, by the way. I have it large right now. It auto is just makes it so huge on my screen. I like it to like that, but better. The advanced OpenGL, I think that's that, um, that uh, occlusion um, that they were talking about. Um, that, I don't know if that really helps or not. I mean, the frame, well, let's see, Fraps is actually capping my frame at 30 frames a second, so I don't know what I'm getting. Um, or what the difference would be. Smooth lighting, of course, I always have that on. Um, graphics, far render distance, so. Um, you know, statistics. This is interesting, so it tells you how many times, so, yeah. I've actually played a couple times beforehand, you can tell. Um, how long I've played. Just how much swimming I've done, wow. It's kind of interesting that it knows a lot of this already, because I haven't done a lot of this. So I'm guessing those are miles, or those meters. Meter, okay, yeah, metric. Kilometers. Um, 158 jumps. <laughs> so it tells you how much jumping you've been doing. That's interesting. Um, it tells you how many times you've crafted a block, or used and mined. Okay. Yeah, so these are reset. This is all stuff I was playing around with before I started recording. Okay. So yeah, that's interesting. Items. Items used. Or items depleted. Crafted and, and used. So that's quite interesting. And now I'm getting asked to play Portal 2 on Steam. Um, by the way, that's kind of... I've been... The main reason why I haven't played a lot of Minecraft is I've been distracted with a bunch of other games. I've been playing Need for Speed World. I've been playing uh, Forsaken World. And Portal 2... The minute Portal 2 came out, I started playing that and beat it in the same sitting. So, um, I'm actually planning, I was planning on recording it, and I forgot to start recording and got into the game. Didn't record my first playthrough, kind of, I'm kind of disappointed about that, because I know 
it would have been more interesting to record my first playthrough. But, um, see, now I'm jumping around. I'm going to add to my jump statistics. Um, so I think I'm going to play through again and record it that time and throw it up as episodes on my YouTube channel. So I'll give you guys some non-Minecraft content. I know some of you are not going to like that. Um, oh, but I, we only like Minecraft. But um, that is a poor impression of my fans. I apologize for that. Anyways, <laughs> we're going to. I'm going to do some Portal 2 videos. Um, I think I, th I love the game. The game was great. I enjoyed it very much. And it came on my birthday, um, which yes, um, I don't know when this will be. You'll, you'll see this video, but uh, my birthday was on April nineteenth. Uh, the same day the game came out. Why is the minecart off the track? Is that you? Was that you? Pick that up. Um, anyway, so I was playing around with some booster. <laughs> I was having some fun here. So I made a little uh, little loop track, and actually I caught a, a pig in it. Let's see if I can catch a pig in it again. And he kind of sat there and rode around on it. But a booster, I've noticed with playing with it, it seems to boost better. Yeah, see, now it's going faster now that I'm in it. It seems to boost better while you're in it than it does if you're not in it. Um, I don't exactly know how far it'll take you. Um, I've heard complaints that it's not very far. That it boosts you, or at least not as far as the the double cart booster or the cart booster. Oh, there you go, got a pig in it. Look at it go faster now that there's a pig in it. Look at him go. All right. So, anyways, we're gonna. So we got that. So it's the those carts. It's the detector carts. Now the detector carts. Okay, come on, sheep. Get out of the way. Whoa, what are we doing? There. That was interesting. Um, so let's let's kill that power. And then as soon as it hits, it breaks. So unpowered booster tracks stop you. Powered booster tracks go. Um, so I'm going to collect all this stuff. We'll do some other. We'll do some more testing with booster tracks here quick. Um, I want that back guy. I want it back. Thank you. So let's see here. I got a full inventory. I'm gonna clean that up. Oh, and there went my axe. So let's collect all this minecart stuff. I think the uh, mob spawn code has been adjusted again because it seems like my dark room is spawning a lot more now than it was before, so I'm thinking it was just a bug. So, got all the tracks collected up here, all the track parts. Um, so one thing I found interesting is if, let's do something like this. Okay, so you have this. Okay, this that's powered, which multiple power tracks in a row will power each other off of one torch. So that's kind of neat. Um, and then you'd say you have something like a button. Um, and I need something. Let's see. So a lever. Let's say button. Button. Trying to figure out how I'm going to put this. Where it'll still power that. Oh, yeah. I can put it right there. That's right. Okay. So let's say I got a button there. That button will power that. So you push it, powers it. And then you got the boost. And you've got sheep. Go away. Go away. You too. I probably shouldn't be doing this testing on a grassy area. So, like that won't do nothing. You push the button, it boosts. And then it breaks on the other end. Which, uh... There, let's push it back. Okay, and it breaks. So then it stops. Okay. So, the reason I did that is because, um, 
you know, I want to do multiple, but I don't want it to stop me right there. Because I have learned that if a cart is pushed up against a block on a booster, and you're in it, you push the button, it starts with no assistance. And then actually, I bounced. I don't know if you saw on that side, I actually bounced. Oh, what's, it, what's going on here? I think I'm having recording. I, I've upgraded to Windows 7 in the process of, uh, of my time off from doing videos as well, and I think it's not liking recording to the same drive that I play off of, so I might have to change my recording location. Anyways, so I might freeze up every once in a while until I get that fixed. Um, so where was I? Oh, yeah. So as long as it's butting up against a block, you push the button, Oops, and then off it goes. And then you notice I bounced and go back, and I'm up against the block. So that is a very simple booster. Um, now how far it goes is the question. So let's go make some changes to my existing booster, or my existing track system. And let's see how far it takes me, how far it gets me. And actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some more redstone and stuff and gold, and that way I can make a bunch of booster tracks and kind of put one in every one, every so often where I need one. Watch it get for walking in front of me, sheep. Don't look at me like that. Um, that way I can do the entire track with boost. Go away. All right, so I got all my stuff. Oh, I need my redstone torch. Okay. So I'm going to head back. We're going to clear out. We're going to rearrange some more inventory, call it pick up stuff I need. And then um, I'll kind of I'll make some uh, boosters and stuff. All right. So it's going to be night here. Um, so first we're going to we're going to make some stuff while it's night. And then we're going to jump in the bed here quick. Uh kind of fast forward it through. So I have um, the stuff I need to make uh, powered rails, which is very, very simple. It's the same as um, the regular rail. Uh, let's make a couple here. It's it's the same as the regular rail recipe, except you use gold. So it's actually, now we're going to run out of gold all the time. Um, I'll, have to, I'll have to mine all that gold I missed. Um, so it's gold and a stick and redstone like that exactly like that it gives you six so we're gonna have a nice little stack of 24 there and um, uh, I probably should make some more redstone torches I don't want too many they're easy to make I can make them without a crafting bench um, so let's see, we got redstone torches, we got detector rails. Detector rails are also really easy to make, um, except, you know, it's, it's iron again. So you got six iron, a stick, or no, not a stick, I apologize. Redstone and a pressure plate instead of the stick gets you six detector rails. Uh, we'll pick up a, back, a stack of those as well. Or uh, a six, half dozen, there we go, so I have a dozen now. Two dozen powered rail, and a dozen detectors. Um, I don't know why I have fences. I don't need fences. So, and I probably should make, I should have some minecarts somewhere. So we're going to jump on the bed here quick um, and get through the night so that we can go off and play and not worry about monsters too much here. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. That was great. Good job, boys. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> okay, back to bed. <laughs> there we go. I'm glad I have you guys. That was funny. Okay. So, um, I also grabbed some, some, uh, wood here. So in case I need to make more ladders, because who knows where I'm, I'm going to learn to keep ladders on me or stuff to make ladders on me until I get all my ladders fixed. Cause I still have to make, fix my water ladder. Um, so here's that booster track. Now we're going to do, instead of completely destroying all of it and let's see. Yeah. I knew I had some carts.
we're gonna do we're gonna get rid of that booster and actually yeah let's get rid of that track and that track so I'm not screwing it up we'll remake this later if we need to and actually yeah let's do it like this okay so we're gonna take some powered rails gonna put one there and the final one there so let's see how far four in a row gets me um, we are going to put a redstone torch. Put that right there. That'll work. So it's good to know that you can power the diagonals like that. Alright, and then this chest is going to have to move, I think. Because I'm going to need to put the button there. Which means I'm going to have a bunch of carts. That's okay. So, let's see, we need a button. Button right there. And it kind of fades in, but... Alright. So. Let's see how far that gets us. I have a feeling... Yeah, it's already slowing down. I have a feeling we're not going to make it up that. 